more segment with John Hamm um, before you go do the NHL 100. NHL, um, as part of the All-Star Weekend in L.A., has some campaign called Hockey Goes Hollywood that you've seen some of I've these. I've seen some of, the, yeah, some of the ads. They did a nice job. It's very I, – I, first of all, I love having the NHL in L.A. Mm-hmm. Uh, it just – it's it's fun. And I don't know if you – have you you've been to a couple oh, Kings yeah. games, That's I'm great. sure, right? The, they – they have taken to the Kings in a whole other way since the Gretzky generation and when it was like... It's incredible. Uh, I'm not allowed there anymore because their last Stanley Cup uh, mm-hmm. championship, I was at the only game they lost. <laughs> I, was, uh, I, was, I, was the, I was the cooler. Well, that's still the, the only Kings. time I've been to the Stanley Cup Finals was in L.A. It was in L.A.? Yeah. yeah. Incredible. Kings Rangers. And it was great. Kid from St. Louis like that? It was great. So they asked some teams and fans are creating hockey ver- versions of some of the most iconic movie posters <laughs> for the... It's a Winnipeg Jets. Yeah. That's a good one. That's awesome. Uh, Sid Crosby and the Penguins with Scarface. <laughs> Sydney. Also nice. Speak of the devil. Also nice. There's a good one. Uh, Kylo Ren and uh, Kyle Ocposo for the Sabres. Oh, this is Crosby oh, and Ovechkin and nice. face off. Well done. Nice. <laughs> what, what a flick, Travolta. Well done. The Magnificent Cage. Seguin. <laughs> okay. Uh, second. Okay. Cam Fowler of the Ducks. Yep. Okay. P.K. Subban. From the Preds, the Subinator. <laughs> and then boy. Connor McDavid is the golden child. That is, that is very true. He needs a little tiny ponytail. Does he have one? I can't quite see I it. don't know. There you go. It's not bad there, huh? It's great. It's fun. It's creative. Yeah, it's let, fun. Let the kids have fun with it. That's what I always say. Well, the kids, you, you're not on the social media, huh? No. Have you ever been on it once? No. Never once? It's poison. <laughs> Why would you ever do that? It's, it's hey, only awful. Well, it's kind of part of my job. I know what I was saying to somebody. I was like, it's almost like Mark Zuckerberg was like, what if there was an easier way for families to hate each other? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a better way to deliver racist content to your uncle? <laughs> From your uncle? What, is, or, what if there's a way for people to hate each other anonymously and without reproach? I got it. It's called Facebook. There you go. John Ham, everybody. I like it. <laughs> the Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.